The manhunt continues for two murder suspects in Bullock County accused of stealing a man's trailer and then shooting him to death. WDRB's Dakota Sherrick talked with the victim's family about how they're processing everything that happened. It was at this intersection early Saturday morning where Kevin Watts was killed and now his family wants to make sure those responsible are brought to justice. I just wish he was still with us. I miss him every day. Kevin Watts's family is still reeling from his death. Kevin was great. Uh, loved his family, two boys, my nephews, 13 and 14 years old. Uh, everybody loved my brother. Um, and he's loved by a lot of people. The Bullock County Sheriff says around 3 a.m. Saturday, two suspects seen in security footage from Kevin's home stole his trailer using a stolen white Dodge pickup truck, a trailer that held a race car he'd built with his two sons but never had a chance to drive. Kevin's brother Earl says once Kevin realized what was going on, he followed the thieves in his own car while his wife called 911. <laughs> The suspects had crashed into a tree not far from the home at the intersection of Woodsdale Road and Cedar Grove Road. Kevin crashed into them. I believe the windshield was probably frosted. You know, he's in a rush. He's trying to get down to the stop sign to see which way these guys might have turned. By the time he came over this hill, I don't think he saw that the truck was already stopped and wrecked. Earl believes after Kevin crashed into them, he got out of the car and at that point was shot. My brother's a warrior. He died like a man. He was defending his family and his property. And to me, you know, some coward shot my brother and left him to die here. And all over a trailer in a car. I mean, all they, fight him, beat him up, run. You know, you didn't have to shoot my brother. The Bullock County Sheriff says they have searched areas around the crash site looking for the suspects. He says they also hope to find evidence, possibly DNA, as they process the stolen truck used by the suspects. It could have been you, me. The family is offering a $10,000 reward in the hopes someone will come forward. Um, find it in your hearts. Um, this could have been your family, you know. Find it in your hearts and please give them a call and get these people off the streets before they hurt somebody else. Anyone with information is asked to contact the Bullock County Sheriff's Office. In Bullock County, Dakota Sherrick, WDRB News.